Hey, good morning guys. It's me, your dad. Uh, excuse me. Totally had some funny in this morning. Totally tastes like funny and totally funny and burp. Anyways. So I know it's been a while since I uploaded a video. But uh I just wanna share some sad news with you guys. I did some thinking while I was in her out. I did some praying, did some thinking, and sad to say, I'm staying another month at the Republic. Staying another month through April. I don't want to do it. The closer I got to my last day, the more I disliked it, the more I just, and it's not that I disliked it, it's just that the more I got anxious to stop doing it. But I'm just not ready. I... I'm just not ready. Uh, I'm not ready to leave money on the table like that. I'm not where I want to be to to do to, to leave the papers. I um I know I can do it. You know I you know I'm replacing it with the insurance thing, and I know I can do the insurance. I know I can do it. I I know the the kept the possibilities there to make. You know, to even do more than that was with the papers with this. But I just didn't prepare. I just pushed it off. I didn't prepare. Uh, kept on doing other things. And you know what? It's all excuses. It's all excuses. That's all it is. 100% excuses. Uh, my fault. I let myself down. 100% um, excuses that stopped me from doing it. I should have had at least four or five policies written by now. I should have had an extra surplus of money uh, to you know, to cover me when the actual stop throwing and and I should have just been, I should have been further along, but you know, life happens. You know, I just got busy doing other things, put other things on. I didn't prioritize like I should have and uh, it's come to bite me in the butt. Now, so pushing back my goals another 30 days, pushing back it's really not pushing back my ultimate goal 30 days because I'll get it done. It's just I'm going to have to work harder in the amount of time that I have to accomplish those goals. So it closed my range by 30 days. Um, I want to start going back to the gym. Can't do that for another 30 days. I wanted to just start, you know, enjoying the apartment a little bit more, but I can't do that for another 30 days. It's just a, a snowball of problems not problems, but a snowball of issues and a snowball of domino effect of things that just happened because I didn't prepare and because I just didn't do what I needed to do to make it happen. Um, and I apologize, guys, to you guys first off for you know for focusing videos around around this you know this insurance stuff and you know trying to push you guys into doing it and uh, and all the you know, the stuff and, you know, again, pushing you guys into doing it. I mean, you know, you guys may be comfortable where you're at. You guys may, may like where you are. You guys may be okay where you are. And that's completely fine. I'm not with me. I'm not comfortable where I'm at. I'm not okay where I'm at. I am not where I want to be. You know, my goals, I'm, you know, my goals are, are, you know, aren't going to accomplish themselves. I've got to do them. You know, and I'm just not comfortable where I'm at, and I want to be somewhere different. I want to be somewhere different. I want 23 to be different than 22. I want 23 to be better than 22, and I shouldn't put my wants and my goals onto you guys. They may not be your goals. Like I said, you might be good where you're at. You might be you may be fine where you are and not want to do anything different. And I apologize if I push this on you. But you know, this was a big thing for me. You know, uh, a reason I did this was, you know, because, you know, your mom, you know, stated that she had a need for the serve, you had a need for it. Uh, she was even paying too much somewhere else, and I wanted to see what I could do to, to get her something better at a better cost, and, and I did, and I'm good about that, and you know, your mom's good with that, and you know, I accomplished that, but that opened up this door to, you know, that in my research opened this door to the possibility of things that I could do, the thing I could do to you know to make things better and I know I can do it and 
you know, I just didn't do it. And the funny thing is, is I know that we're all like, we're all, I got to see it to believe it type of people. And I've got to see people be successful doing it to, you know, to know that it's not a scam, a gimmick or whatever. But there's one thing I learned at Rocket Mortgage that they have these, they have these 20 rules, these 20 codes that they live by. And there, some of them are simple, like, you know, do the right thing. That's obvious. You know, do the right thing. But that's one of the goals that they live by. That's one of the codes that they live by. You know, another is, you know, we'll figure it out. You know, again, that's just a code to live by, pretty simple. But one that I really like, one of my favorite ones, isn't, you know, I'll believe it when I see it. But it's a twist on that. It's, I'll see it when I believe it. And that one hit me hard because I'm like, you know what? If I believe in what I'm doing, if I believe in what I'm seeing, if I believe in what I'm doing and believe in, in, in what I'm working for and what I'm working on, then I'll see the results come, you know, come to fruition. I'll see the results happen and I'll see my gains come upon that. And I know that and I do believe it. I just have to put my effort with the belief and then see everything happen. Um, so I know that I can make this happen. I know that I can make this work. I'm confident that I can. I just haven't put forth the effort to do it. And it's not gonna happen by itself. It's not gonna fall on my lap. And you know, life doesn't work that way. You know, I just have to, I just have to do it. I've gotta be done with excuses. I've gotta, and then this hurt, this one, this setback, you know, uh, mentally hurt me because, you know, again, it's pushing everything back that I wanted to do and it sucks and, it, I'm, and I was in control of that and I and I did that. So anyways, I'm rambling and I did, this video is longer than what I wanted, but I'm, just, I'm super disappointed in myself. I'm super, you know, upset that, you know, this happened the way it did, but hey, tomorrow's another day. You know, it is what it is, we move forward and, you know, we, we come out better and stronger from this. So anyways, have a good day guys. Um, I know we're all looking forward to that day when I quit papers, but 30 more days. All right, um, and uh, that's all. Have a good day, I'll talk later, bye guys.